keep up with your medicine. It can be very boring and you can forget. You can go to school and think, maybe I don't need it today. I'll be fine and be in gym class and be stuck. Please make sure that if you have an inhaler, that you have it with you at all times. A lot of kids do best when they use their inhaler even before they're going to play sports. They're out at recess, they go to gym class. That allows them to really play harder, play longer, and get exercise, which is really important for everybody to get, but especially for kids with asthma. After when you take your inhaler, you can do all other stuff that you want, but just make sure you have your inhaler with you or in your purse or in your pocket. Sometimes it's upstairs in my classroom and in my book bag and in the office. Know what your triggers are and try to avoid them. Different people have different triggers. Pollen. Cold weather. And I play in the grass. Certain smells may make things worse. Oh, and animals like their fur. If I'm around um, fur or grass, I can wash my face and wash my hands and try to stay away from it. It can be hard to stop what you're doing and take a break and have to go find your inhaler, but it's a lot harder to wind up in the emergency room or the hospital. Sometimes when I'm like running a lot, I get out of breath, so I have to stop and take a breather. And then if, I, like, if my chest still feels tight, I have to take my inhaler. Mm -hmm. It looks like you're playing an instrument. Mm -hmm. <laughs> a spacer is a plastic tube that holds that medicine in the tube so that you can breathe it into your airways where it works. If you put that inhaler right in your mouth and you just spray it right in there, most of it hits the roof of your mouth. It doesn't find its way down into your breathing pipes where it's going to help you. So it's really almost a waste to do it that way. So if you're going to take the time to stop and use your inhaler, you really ought to have your spacer with you. I use my spacer every day. And you put it in your mouth and then you push this down. You breathe in, count to five, and breathe out, and then do it for a second time. Let everyone know. Talk to your teachers, talk to your friends. If they see you slip up, tell them, hey, can you tell me and remind me to take my inhaler today? And they'll keep up with you. If you're in school and you're having any kind of discomfort or problems related to your asthma, see your school nurse. Always ask for support. 